Welcome to Wheel and Sprockets Bicycle Fit Studio. The reason for bike fit is that we want to identify our customer's bike size and ideal position before we get the bike so that we know exactly what to expect and we can optimize the frame size, the frame manufacturer, and the frame geometry to what the purpose of the bike is. So right now we're going through another step in the bike fit process uh, to shoot video. Video capture is an important tool to show the rider exactly what we're doing and what we want to accomplish. So now we're working into the physical assessment. I need to understand how Tim works as a person. So we're gonna start at the feet, work through the hips, and all the way through up past the head. We'll introduce a gait analysis as well. Gait analysis is important on a ground-based application to see how Tim has evolved and how he walks and how his ankles, knees, and hips function. And so then once we understand how he moves on the floor, then we can apply that to the bike. So now we're gonna use Retool as our motion capture device. So we're gonna use eight LEDs to identify how Tim moves on the bike. So this is the Zen tool. It's the most accurate way to measure a bike. And uh, we use the Retool, the 3D motion capture, and the four LEDs to measure the end or tip of the wand. And so in the background here, we see the final uh, result of the important measurements. Quite often, people come in after they've purchased a bike. And uh, once in a while, we'll have situations where the bike doesn't allow the optimal position based on their strength and flexibility and range of motion. So what we'd rather do is when they come in before they buy a bike, we find out all of the information that we need to, so then we can better ha we can have an, a better educated decision coming into the purchase of a new bike.